to compel him, but the ball went in. And someone's down. And it looks like it's Giannis grabbing that right, or excuse me, that left knee. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. There was a lot of contact on the alley there. This is something you absolutely don't want to see. Oh, I can see the hyperextension. Mm. Yep, the left knee. Oh, oh man. Can't even look at it. No. I mean, it is stone silence in this building. And as much as they had been getting on Giannis Antetokounmpo, these fans understand in terms of sportsmanship, mm -hmm. this is not good. To try to help Giannis to his feet. And here's the applause from this crowd. Again, it looked like the left knee kind of hyperextended, buckled as he went down to the floor along with Capella. Just landed awkwardly. And here's the true test. Is he able to put any weight on it? See Bucks trainer Scott Faust checking it out. And the ovation for one of the great players in the NBA, Giannis Adepikumbo. Hobbling. They will take him back to the locker room. You never want to see this at all. As he's explaining to his brother, Thanasis. <laughs> and was just getting kind of warmed up in this third quarter, right? He came out flying all over the court after... A tough time in the first half. Incidentally, that last basket was put in by Capella. Giving the Hawks the 10-point lead. Okay, now he's was there unassisted, so that's a little bit more encouraging. Now that he's walking like that, that, that that's a welcome sight. Mm. If you're a Bucks fan. Nonetheless, this is scary. Very scary. 